destroy the indigenous people. Beyond nature, Au cours de sa carrière, M. Robert Redford avait montré l'immense talent pour raconter et incarner des histoires qui aident à comprendre des réalités souvent complexes. M. Redford est un ambassadeur de la grande diversité humaine, un médiateur, un passeur des histoires des peuples autochtones. Et c'est pourquoi l'UNESCO est si heureuse de l'accompagner aujourd'hui dans cette initiative. And I think the people that we, we first must pay attention to are the indigenous cultures, because they have great stories to tell us, because they were the closest to the land. They, they came out of areas that, where they had to live close to the land. And that relationship of being close to the land is a, is a relationship a lot of us have lost over time with technology and development and so on. And I think it's time to go back <coughs> and listen to what those cultures have to tell us, the stories they have to tell us about the land and who's going to be more, who's going to know more about how, what the threat is than those people who are threatened. I think the word is out. I think enough people are, are now directly affected by what's happening that they want to see change. When we did the 60 Minutes piece with Dan Rather, uh, The show was very successful, but I got punished for it locally. And in the midst of all that, I mean, there was threats to my family. There was an ugly time. But there was a, a donation that came from a, a kid who was 11 years old. And he donated a dollar to the cause because he said, look, this is my future. I want to do whatever I can to protect it. And I thought, wow, that's a great story. Mandan Bromi, time Grand Pondan time, and Forest Bromi Pundan or Tumbuna Sawa is Tablon, Miss Sawa is Tap. Sorry, Minas read Minas or Mino Sabaman two, Mino Sandis two, me man of place. One am something me got I and a tin tin. Tassel looks away, you pra, he got satellite or you pra, Sambra Sabaman two is Tapna. He see the Panimadro, Karamet Sans. One am one am something or lapun man Mary cried or nature. I'm awesome. Now, past time, I'm sun saw is the blown away. Now, uh, eight bra, nine bra, yeah, awesome. Sun come close to. Now, one am something, uh, cloud, um, people in a canopy, so I'm giving federal or grant or plan. This is I mean, no come, I mean, go finish. Now, what are me plus out in water or mountain? Um, big plant rice so we come to this is what I don't know how to stop. So this is how I'm stopping this. It's, it's, it's clear that they remove the rights of indigenous peoples in the operational text of the agreement. So it's really frustrating for us right now. I'm really sad. It's not supposed to happen. In this big conference, people promise that COP in Paris will come up with something with a new spirit, new spirit to change what we've been doing so far with the world. And with indigenous people all over the world, we've been trying to tell us this, our stories. We've been building our own media. We've been trying to say what happened. And also we give our contributions. And Mr. Redford, maybe you can also help us to talk to anybody in high level who knows about this, please. Please put back the rights of indigenous peoples in the text because that is really mean a lot to us. And anything, any agreement related to UNFCC, uh, related to climate change, have to really ensure the rights of indigenous peoples. Those people who really protect the forest, protect the environment, protect the biodiversity, <laughs> need to be protected. The other night, my one-year-old was a fever pressed against my chest. Together, we wrestled with a thermometer that read 99.8 degrees. The doctor says technically 100.4 is a fever. But I can see her flushed face, how she drapes across my lap, listless. And I think, what a difference. 
a few degrees can make. Scientists say if humans warm the world more than two degrees, then catastrophe will hit. Imagine North American wildfires increasing by 400%, animal extinction rising by 30%, freshwater declining by 20%, just one meter of sea level rise, and 15% of Bangladesh gone. Entire island nations gone, thousands, millions left wandering. My daughter left wandering, wondering what happened. Because beyond the discussions, beyond the statistics, beyond the politics, there are people, there are faces all the way out here. There is a baby walking wobbly on the edge of a reef, not yet underwater. Thank you. <laughs>